Let's break down four major roster decisions looming for the New York Giants. Starting us off, do they give Daniel Jones his fifth-year option? Both Dable and Shane expressed their excitement to work with quarterback Daniel Jones, who is entering his fourth year under his third head coach. Despite Jones's inconsistency and turnover issues, the Giants brass hasn't given up on him. While Shane and Dable might be excited to work with Jones, it doesn't mean they're ready to commit to him beyond 2022. This spring, the Giants must decide whether or not to exercise Jones' fifth-year option or have him be a free agent after the 2022 season. Up next, what veterans will the Giants cut? One of the first topics that Shane touched on is his desire to cut $40 million in cap space. In order to accomplish this, they have to cut several veterans from the New York Giants roster. The obvious player that comes to mind is Sterling Shepard. Shepard is the longest tenured Giant, but he's been unable to stay healthy in his six seasons with Big Blue. Other notable veterans who could be salary cap casualties are linebacker Blake Martinez along with tight end Kyle Rudolph. Shane will surely have his hands full in finding ways to create cap space. Up next, the Giants need to find a viable backup to Daniel Jones. All signs point to Jones being the starter for the 2022 season, but as everyone knows, he's been injured in each of his three seasons. So it's obvious the Giants will need to find a viable back to Jones, unlike last season when Mike Glennon was number two on the depth chart. Look for Shane and Dable to try to bring in a free agent quarterback such as Mitchell Trubisky or Teddy Bridgewater to push Jones to be the starter and to be ready to come in if Jones gets injured again. And finally, will they look to trade Saquon Barkley? Aside from his rookie season when he won Offensive Rookie of the Year, Barkley has been unable to play a full season. Now he's entering the final year of his contract after averaging just 3.7 yards last season. Injuries and a bad offensive line have derailed Barkley's once promising future. With the New York Giants being years away from being contenders, it may behoove them to trade the second overall pick from the 2018 draft to a contender and get draft capital that can help them for years to come.